Hey, it's Red Shooter, and today I just wanted to do a video for you guys of the new Super Mario Party Jamboree, the Bowser Kaboom Squad game. So, this is the team that I'm gonna enter this match with, with uh, Noah, J Mario 97, Emiko. We got Chromium, Nepowis, Jiho, and some Japanese player. Since I'm still new to Bowser Kaboom Squad, right, and still trying to get used to the game and, you know, how things can work when you're on that battlefield, I'm just sticking to easy mode and on the first map, Charging Chucks. So I knew jumping into this that this would be a lot easier with actual human players because I played two rounds of training and this is my first match uh, online with actual human players. Yeah, so my, uh, my mindset going into this battle is um avoid bowser find the nearest crate destroy the crate let my buddies know that there's a crate near me so they can come over and hit it with me i grab a bomb or two and i head straight to the cannon and in the first uh, 40 seconds when i got to the crate that i was hitting um a couple of buddies j mario 97 and chromium came by to help pick up a couple bombs with me and we rushed it back to each, and we already shot the cannon once at Bowser. And this is where the fun part comes in, because in the in the this is the same round, but my mindset going into the second, I guess you can say like, well, not really phase, because he has three phases. But basically, after we shot him, we finally shot him once. We filled up the cannon and blasted him. I decided I wanted to be the distraction. Because I love to be the distraction. And I had Bowser going for quite a bit. You guys just enjoy the show. So, even though my buddies couldn't get to 20 bombs, right, the limit in which you can fire the cannon at Bowser, they managed to get 17, right? The entire time that I was playing, uh, right, distraction, I was distracting Bowser, they managed to get 17 bombs in there, right? So that's not so bad. We probably just got a little bit lucky. Uh, we just probably got a little bit unlucky with the, with where the crates are dropping, I think. So in this video, I mainly just wanted to focus on me, my buddies, and our teamwork against Bowser on the Charge and Chucks map. So I'm going to be skipping all the minigames, but basically, we did pretty good. We got rank B. Uh, we played Ball Volley. That's what the minigame was. After we completed the minigame Ball Volley, the banana is the item I chose. And as soon as the match started, right, we had a crates drop right near the cannon. So I'm like, yo, everybody get this. But as that happened, as this was happening, I saw Bowser was heading straight towards us. I'm like, wait, this would be the perfect time for the banana. I don't know. Like, I haven't mastered this part of the game yet. So I didn't know which button was my banana button, right, to, like, to put it over my head and then throw it. So when I ran at Bowser... He freaking rammed right into me. I felt kind of dumb, but you know, it's, it's all fun, right? It's all a learning process. But the crate was still there because someone else distracted him. Yup, you're gonna see Noah. Noah, the beautiful, courageous Noah. She managed to distract Bowser away from the crate that we were hitting and we were able to get just a few more bombs in and that was just enough to shoot the cannon which I'm really glad because I don't know oh okay yeah it does I just checked right now as I'm recording this that the bombs carry over to the next round so that means my distraction that I was doing in round one actually came in clutch it wasn't for not it wasn't for nothing yeah and then you'll see in this round that Noah decided to fill the role of distraction and I kind of was like oh man I like being the distraction but you know she was doing really good so I was, you know what this is a team effort right we have to work together to win that's the most important thing and right because of that Noah distracted Bowser enough for us to get 21 bombs in that cannon and we hit Bowser again thanks to Noah continuing her distraction of Bowser that ends round two we did 42 damage so far and here we are, me and my team, going into round three. The minigame we played was match that item, and we got rank A. So we got better items this round. So my mindset going into this round is uh, 
I'm gonna rely on Noah, because she was re doing really good at distracting Bowser. So I was like, I'm gonna just let her do that. So in this round, I just decided to go for crate hunting. Luckily, one appeared near our cannon, so that saved us a lot of time, right, wasted from running across the map. And you guys gotta check this out. This is round three. This was the round that uh, we got bonus time, where you get two times the damage and golden bombs appear. All the bombs become golden. And I did get one because, right, it, the bonus time just began as I was near the cannon anyway. So I grabbed the golden bomb, threw it in. And I couldn't find any crates. I found one that was near us, but Bowser destroyed everything with flames, ruining the golden bombs and ruining the crate. But I found two golden bombs in the corner of the map. So I was like, let me grab this. I'm going to just grab one. Because if you grab more than one bomb, you walk slower, right? Because the bombs are heavier. You're carrying more bombs. So I grabbed one and it starts blinking. I'm like, oh no, time's running out. I got to get to the cannon. And just before I could throw it in, the time ran out. But, other people threw golden bombs into the cannon, and that nailed us the final hit we needed. 42 damage on Bowser. And there you have it. He dropped the Power Star, which he's not very smart. If he had the Power Star on him, why didn't he use it? I don't know. He probably got a little too hot-headed, right, thinking he don't need it. Right, his ego got the best of him. And yeah, me and my team, we did it. I love the animations of all of them attacking. <laughs> yeah. So we did really good. We got four stars for speed clear as well. Finish. So yeah, guys. I just wanted to show you guys my first Bowser Kaboom squad, I think it's called, with other online players. And it's definitely a lot more... It, it's just a lot more calculated, you know what I mean? When you got multiple brains all thinking and we know what's best for the team... It's easy, one, two, three. But not only that, but it actually was on easy mode. So we'll see how normal is, how normal mode is. And hard, I wanna see that. Thanks for watching, guys.